know what that means. Welcome to the correct news. It is uh, the dumb D of the day. Now, we just covered a woman who was pleasuring herself on the beach. And you, you would think that that would be the dumbest story of the day. You have no idea. This is from the Daily Mail, who I don't advise going there because the pop-ups will shut your computer down. Worst site ever. Daily Mail. Joe is a nightmare choice on whether to leave troops in to attack in Afghanistan to attack ISIS K or pull them out by August 31st. As Biden orders Pentagon to plan strikes, how can he hunt down terrorists behind a double suicide blast? Pause. The rest of this whole story you know. Just pause right there because we're going to talk a little bit about Joe Biden. This idiot just said that he was going to track down the terrorist responsible for killing the Marines and injuring others in Afghanistan. Sounds noble, right? Trump would have done it. He'd have gone after him. What are you mad about? They're suicide bombers! They're dead! You want to know where they are, Joe? They're on the wall. They're on the floor. They're splattered on a few victims' faces. They might be... You might be able to find them on the roof. There's probably some over there by the parking garage. You don't! They blew themselves up, you twit! Here's what bothers me so much about that. Every time Trump did so much as the smallest misspeak, he'd get railed. I mean, literally railed. You guys know exactly what I mean. Don't act like you don't. You know exactly what I mean. For instance, remember the time that uh, he was touting UV therapy? There is something called UV light therapy. I, I don't know a lot about it, but I've covered it in the past for the Fukushima updates. I knew it existed. In a nutshell, it's a way of injecting ultraviolet light into you, and the benefits therein are can be, can be rather substantial. It's, it's not a bad treatment. And he was wondering whether or not it would be useful for COVID-19, which is a prudent question. He was crucified. He may as well have asked if the Easter Bunny was going to bring the vaccine on the wings of the tooth fairy. He was shlacked for it. But this guy, this Biden, Biden can say anything. There's nothing wrong with that, right? Dear God, friends, how does that work? Can anybody tell me how that works? He got off the plane and he said, my butt's been wiped. And nobody asked him. Let me guess, you think, you think I'm kidding, right? No. Let, let, me, let me explain this to you again, because this actually happened. In the free world, where every little nuance is analyzed and watched. This Domkov got off of an airplane and was asked about a situation at the border. And his answer was, My boat's been wiped! The left and Snopes and others, and of course you know Snopes isn't true, Snopes and others have said, well, it might have been something else. It might have just sounded that way. Well, okay. Why has nobody asked him about it? You don't think they would have asked him? You mean to tell me if Donald Trump got off an airplane and said, my butt's been wiped, nobody would have asked him what the hell he meant? Can't you see that they're covering for this man? That this is a purposeful communist takeover. Communists do not normally win elections, they take over. Listen, if you don't believe he said it. My immediate response was it was going to be a non-issue when he said it. A non-issue. He's tired. He probably could have worded it better, but oh my God. You people are asking me all these questions. My butt's been wiped, really. Awful way to put it. But nobody ever asked him about it. Nobody ever inquired what, what he meant. You think it might have been due to a cover-up? You think it might have been due to the fact that they want Americans to understand how stupid he is, but when he when he makes them, well, not even stupid, sick. I'm not even going to say stupid, sick. Uh, was, the moment it comes time 
for him to be removed. That's what's going to happen, so that you can usher in the communism of Kamala Harris. But above and beyond that, and she was rejected. She was the first Democrat rejected in debates when it was happening, and yet now she's VP. Because they got a senile man to agree to it, that's how. Should be considered elder abuse, perhaps. But when he messes up so severely that it can't even be covered for, like, my butt's been wiped, then they don't mention it. And here's what I'm going to say if you think I'm making a big deal out of nothing on this. The man who's trying to find these suicide bombers and bring them to justice after they've blown themselves up. So he meant ISIS K. He didn't mean them. The man can't get through a single sentence without five or six mistakes. He can't do it. He simply cannot do it. Here's an experiment I have for you. The next time someone says hi to you, say, my butt's been wiped. See what the reaction is. And then ask, why? Why didn't Biden get that question? Why didn't he get that reaction? It's happening right in front of us, people.